Okay, y'all, so let me tell you. We were supposed to go to the club last night, right? But, um, sis had got, like, extremely drunk. She was falling all over the ground. Bitch, fuck you. What is your name, sugar? <laughs> Game all, sugar. Don't put your game on. Don't put your game on. Don't escort me to my room. Fuck you, girl. Baby, why you sitting on the floor in the bathroom? Cause my man don't love me. Get your ass out of my bed. And go get in your bed, bitch. Big thing in the bed. Bitch, get out my bed. And go get in your bed. Girl, you got a whole bed in your room. Why you grabbing your crutch? My vagina. Come on, let me help you get out my bed. Now, bitch, if I drag your ass out of this bed. Ooh. Come on, see, Chino wants you to get up. Come on. <laughs> Shut up. I wasn't here, but Daryl was here. I drove up here, knocked on the door for about five, ten minutes. Nobody opened the door, so I went all the way back home. This was a 30-minute drive, mind you, and these bitches didn't even open the fucking door. Is that so? Girl, fuck you, David. Don't talk to me, bitch. Why? What I Girl, what Girl. haven't you done? Sad. So she was like, the reason I talk about you all the time and I always say you ain't got no walls and stuff like that. And she, I was, really love she was like, because secretly, like, I still got feelings or feelings for you. I knew it. Like, beyond, you know, like, just a friend and a brother. But, girl, when I tell her all the shit that she said this morning, that she's... That she said it ain't real. real. That's, that's the one thing that she said last night that's a lot. I knew she liked you, child, so she want the dick. Girl, Let me get myself my together and come over there so we can talk about this. I know. I knew she want that good old car. Girl, she was grabbing my penis and everything last night, girl. Don't remember. She grabbed your penis? Yes, girl. I said to her, I said, Dave, I said, I got a shit. She, she said, girl, go ahead and sit down. So I sat down and she did right there. Girl, I'm sitting on the toilet. Been trying to play with my bird while I'm sitting on the toilet. Mm-mm. Girl. <laughs> Why are you shitting, Daryl? Yes, yeah, why well, I'm shitting, girl. She don't remember none of this. So when I get up here, I have some words for both of them, bitch. You hear me? Ew. Whose little rat ass dog is this? This bitch is ugly. Who whose dog is this? This dog is a mess. That dog is a mess. He, well, whose is it? I'm dog Dogs and you can't even sit your own dog. Don't look, don't talk about Chino no, I'm it's she, Who part. cut? <laughs> Did you cut it with some scissors? It's a work in progress. Mo Chino. Oh, oh my. Daryl. Oh, Chino. Daryl got you looking a mess. Daryl. Look at this damn rabbit mixed with a dog. Y'all had me drive all the way up here, Daryl, and nobody opened the door. But well, bitch, I told you to come back. Move, mutt. <laughs> oh, sis. <gasps> no. <laughs> sis, what happened to the bear? I killed the motherfucker. But why? I don't want shit to remind me of him. Sis, you were so drunk last night. I saw the video. That was a good thing. I wanted to be drunk. What? The bear had to do, the bear didn't do anything to you, sis. The bear reminds me of him. So you killed the bear and you killed him. I was a waste of time for him anyway. That's what he said? You can't come see me. You can't spend time with me. I don't deserve that. You don't. So why are you sitting here miserable when you know that you don't deserve it then? That's a good question. We as women, because <laughs> I'm teaching, we as women, we like to sit here and we put ourselves down like we the ones that fucked up. We didn't fuck up, sis. Was calling him, giving her undivided attention, making sure he was good, being a good a wife, woman, girlfriend, whatever you want to call it. And you over here and like, you fucked up. You didn't fuck up. He fucked up. So why are you at home miserable? I know your feelings and emotions are in it, but girl, you didn't fuck up. He should be upset that he lost you, but you over here upset that you lost something that didn't give a fuck about you. How does that make any sense, y'all? I don't understand. Sis, I'm going to need for you to get up and understand your worth, honey. I want to stay in my bed. I'm going to take off work the next three days. So you finna lose money over a nigga while he making money. Girl, that don't add up, sis. What are you doing? Why, Muhammad? You going up to where? What is tonight? What you doing? I'm with Daryl and them right now. Tonight I got nothing to do with you.
12.2. Girl, mad you froze real bad. Oh, here you go. I need to tell this boy that I can't come get him in. You sure can't unless you come with you. I can't get it out of here. I mean, oh. Let me edit that part out in the vlog. <laughs> 21 out. Let's see. I want some coffee. Dave, sit this down under the table. <laughs> we finna have some birds. You ain't finna watch what I'm about to say. If you finna eat. Honey, I'm gonna get drunk at the end of the conversation. No, you're not. Okay, so we gonna take it all the way back to a year ago. A year ago? A year ago. What happened a year ago? Ain't got nothing to do with me. I'm trying to help this depressed ass bitch. <laughs> Did you? Uh-oh. -uh. Or did you not tell me that you and Corey stopped talking? Cause he because, didn't hit me. Because no, no, no. Let me. I'm talking. Oh. No, I broke up with him. No. Pause. I don't remember. Well, I don't remember what I said. You came. You came to me, and you told me out of your mouth that you left him. You just up, stop calling, stop texting, and stuff like that. I got ghosts. Yeah. Right. I did. He just confirmed that. Dad oh, so you talked to Corey? Yeah. I just talked to call him. Mm. He was all down and depressed and stuff like that. Made me feel bad for you. Mm. Because the story that you gave me about him leaving you, but in essence, you left him. I did. I did. I, I never, I don't, I don't know what I said. But then on top, I did leave him because what, what, what happened was he stopped giving me attention. He was acting like, you know, like we we're supposed to do something. And then come to find out he was off for a week. So I said, motherfucker, you can't come see me. I'm but then, but then, David, this is a But how you know he wasn't doing something? But hold on, but hold on. Even still, past that, like I said, it's always two sides to every story. Mm -hmm. Okay. He said when y'all was kicking, y'all weren't even in a relationship. He said y'all were y'all were exclusive together, like, but not the title of we're together as a boyfriend, sense. boyfriend. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. Because sometimes you date because, people, no, but you're not together it yet. Makes, it's not official. It makes, a, it makes a difference because it makes a difference as far as how you would expect the situation to be and how he may perceive a situation. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Because if you perceive the situation that we are in a relationship, we are a couple, we are working. Then you're gonna different. think he you're should do work, relationship you're things. Work, you're gonna work, you're gonna want certain things. You're gonna work, you're gonna want more time. You're mm -hmm. gonna expect different things and stuff like that. But if so you perceive, I would imagine it's the same way now. But, so if, he feel bad. but if he perceives the situation, when, I go to my and drink now? Paul, when you came, when y'all started back talking after a year, okay, he came to you, he said he just got our relationship in December. Hold on, no, we go ahead this conversation when you left him he got back with his ex he dated his ex for a whole year okay you left so when you got he didn't want me and he doesn't want me now you don't know that David. you I left know. you left I left. You're you right. You left. He didn't want me. You said he doesn't you want me. You left because you thought you left because you thought he wasn't giving you attention. But the reason he wasn't giving you the attention that you were expecting was because y'all weren't actually together. And we're not together. You now. were just dating. If you want to know what is what you asked, you need to talk. Right? Stop what running. I think secretly in your mind you expected because yes, y'all had a five month relationship. If we're not together, so I'm not. Matter. Matter. But if you're not together, why are you stressing? But it doesn't matter. Well, matter. Can we drop it? I'm, I'm, I'm single. single. I'm with nobody, but, nobody they, but look how you're fine. acting though. They look how you're acting. Look, fine. Be, I'm okay with that. You don't like to see the real story, the sis. Like, no, we your friends. And we're, we're trying, trying to tell, to tell you. you. And you don't even want to hear us. Hey, I just want to stay in my room for the next five days and not be bothered. I need clarity. You don't ask questions. I don't want clarity from him. If I get clarity for yourself. Yeah. Not once did this man say he's not attracted to you. Where he was and where you were, it's not the same thing. He was happy with kicking it with you. Y'all hanging out. Y'all getting to know each other. To see what Shut the hell up. You. That's what you need to do. But they, why are you like that? Because you sit here and act like you don't care, go do it with somebody else, but then you sit in your room and you drink. And this is the crazy part. You sit here and you want everybody to feel sorry for you. And don't get me wrong, I love you dearly, but I don't feel sorry for you. Then don't. He said, now one time have you ever picked up the phone and actually literally called him? Wait, you was the one. He you said that. The, one. the only time he ever said that to me was in that text message and I said no. I haven't seen you in almost two weeks and it's going to upset me if I FaceTime you and I can't see you face to face. That's what I said to him. That was the only time he ever okay, said that. Even still, David, he said if you got something to say to him, if you want to convey your feelings, why not pick up the phone and actually have a phone conversation with him and not do text? Just like he said that to you, he could have said that to me. Through a text. He could have said it to me over he could have said it to me face to face whenever we hung out. When you got some bunch of shit. David, when I just hung out 30 
first that you didn't even want to talk. You're right. I didn't. Exactly. I didn't. Exactly. But y'all, you wouldn't even be feeling like this or going through what you're going through and had you talk. It's over. He don't want me. No one wants me. It doesn't matter. It doesn't fucking matter. Sus, you're matter. saying that no, because it you're... doesn't matter. Let's just go out. Let's drink. Let's do something. It doesn't matter. No one wants me, and I have to accept that. I'm okay with that. That I'm is okay. not. That's okay. not true. That is not true. That's not. I don't care. 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 Let me go to my room. Let me suffer. Let me go out and spend all of my fucking money. It does not matter. No. No. Because baby, this man just said he doesn't care till we get off of the subject of him. He doesn't care. Baby, he doesn't care. If he doesn't care, he doesn't care. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. You have stuff going on. You won't let him get to you. You won't let him get close to you. Why do you feel he don't care? He doesn't. I'm a waste of time. Why do you say that? Why are you a waste of time though? Just say it. Made it up in his mind. He was having a good time with you. Then how do you not care? So now you want to go? Go. Go. That, you that's just not told him to go. So you, you so if you told him to go, if you told him to go, then what do you expect him to do? He go. Can't. You can't tell somebody to do something that you honestly don't mean, and then when they do it, you get mad about it. So you got to be careful what you say because guys nowadays are going to be like, hey, well if you don't want me around, then fuck it, I'm not going to be around. The sad part about it is, you you can't even own up to the shit that you did wrong. Love don't pay the bills. Anyway, Girl, I can work anyway, so much I that I don't have to miss I recommended that, we okay. actually, that all three of us sit down and have a conversation, and he was definitely up to it. He said he'll be here Friday. And he doesn't want me. He just what said I the man will come here and talk it's to you on Friday. You don't fucking listen. Da David wants to be like that, Daryl, so just let it go, yeah. honey. He wants to be like that. That's crazy. I'm not gonna sit here That's and, crazy. and take time out of my schedule to sit down with y'all, to have a conversation with y'all, to hash out what is what between y'all if you don't wanna have it. If you're not gonna sit here at this table and participate and actually have a level head and actually hear the shit that we're talking about, then no, I don't wanna have it. Because right now this conversation is pointless because you're not hearing anything that I'm saying to you. So if, if we're gonna have the same conversation on Friday, then it's a waste. It's a waste of time. So yes or no, do you wanna have the conversation? I don't want to have this conversation. Just drop it. Just yes drop no. it. Ask later, honey. I just want to go out for a drink. What's going on, honey? Daryl, I don't think you know what you're doing. Girl, I got this. I'm doing the bag, and then I'm gonna do the front. Why didn't you just spend money and go get him cut, Daryl? Cut. She know he got his shots. He ain't healthy. Y'all call Peter. Y'all just heard this. Oh God. Y'all look at Chino. Pray for me. Look. <laughs> Chino. I know you hey. fucking lying. You saw her cookies. Nah, I threw up too. <laughs> Swallowed it. Okay. 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 Okay.